Next up, a snowy owl normally found in the Arctic tundra shows up 3,000 miles away amid palm trees and beaches of sunny Southern California. The extremely rare sighting has transfixed a California community, but as for how the owl arrived there, who who could know? Maybe CNN reporter Jeannie Mose. It's a head scratcher, all right. How did a snowy owl that normally lives in the Arctic tundra end up amid the palm trees of Southern California. I consider it an honor to be able to see the bird. Bird lovers are flocking to Cypress, California to get a peek. It's so exciting to see a bird that does not belong here. Yeah, well, not everyone is excited. There were all these crows that were just dive bombing it and trying to like scare it away. Not so unfazed, the birder who posted this video, Nicholas Ballardis admits, I teared up. A marine biologist told the New York Times it's like seeing Santa Claus on a beach. Wildlife experts are watching the owl like a hawk, even to the point of climbing up a ladder to retrieve a pellet regurgitated by the raptor. Oh, so a treasure right away. The birds expel the indigestible parts of their meals, so the Wetlands and Wildlife Care Center decided to check on the owl's taste in California cuisine. This looks like the skull, yeah, look at that, the skull of some kind of rodent. We know what it ate, but we don't know how it got here. Is it an escaped illegal pet? Or did it hitch a ride on a freighter from up north? Or maybe it just got disoriented and flew too far south. It looks nice and fluffy. Genie Mouse, CNN, New York.